Hey YouTube, I'm Steve Post. You know, we love first time wins in NASCAR and Trevor Bain, when he did his first win, well, he made it big with the Daytona 500. Today, we're gonna talk about Trevor Bain, but we're gonna talk about that first NASCAR Nationwide Series win. It happened nine months after he won the Daytona 500. It was the O'Reilly Auto Parts Challenge at Texas Motor Speedway in the fall, and it was a spectacular win for Trevor Bain. He took it off from Carl Edwards, his teammate, Edwards had dominated the race, but a restart with seven laps to go allowed Trevor Bain to get alongside of him, and Bain put it in the win and scored the victory, his first NASCAR Nationwide Series win. And when you look at where young Trevor Bain was at that point, came out of the box that year, won the Daytona 500, but remember that year also spent some time in the hospital fighting Lyme disease. And so consequently, this win for Trevor at Texas, very, very special for him personally and for his career as it marked him getting back on track back in victory lane and what up to that point had been a roller coaster ride of a season. When looking at the die cast for Bain's first win, and I love what Lionel NASCAR collectibles do with these win cars, all of the debris on the front of the car and the and the marks, the pop marks, all of the debris on the front of the car is good. And this car, the hood does open on it. We have a standard model of this car. We actually have some autographed Trevor Bain cars, autographed by him on the windshield. And we have a flash coat edition as well of that race car. So three options for you to choose from. These cars commemorating Trevor Bain's historic first NASCAR Nationwide Series win are available at your local diecast store or you can check it out at planbsales.com.